Okay, if anyone's having trouble getting um, iZip to work, I'm going to do another one. I've come to um, SVG, lovesvg.com, and I'm just going to choose one of these. How about you are my cup of tea? Okay, so I'm going to click on that one. Then I'm going to scroll down as I had shown you before. I'm going to download the zip file. And if you have iZip, it should automatically come to a page that looks something like this. Then right down here underneath it says Open in iZip. So you can see where it says Zip, You're My Cup of Tea, Zip Archive, and then the next thing down it says Open in iZip. I'll click on that. Then it shows the zipper and it comes goes to all these things and then it just says would you like to extract all files and I say okay and I can get rid of this box here with the add alright so here are all the files that are extracted and the one that I want to open is the SVG the top one and there it is and now what I can do if I want to take put this in uh, Cricut Design Space is I will just go to Cricut Design Space. There it is. All right. New project. I'm going to come to Upload. I'm going to Browse file, Files. And then I'm going to come to iZip. It says there's eight items. And it was the one in the folder called You Are My Cup of Tea. This one. I guess I have to click on it again. And then I have to make sure I get the one that looks like it's two pieces of paper because that's the SVG file. Click on that. And there it is. I'm going to name it. I'll just name it Cuppa and say Done. So there it is uploaded. I can click on it and say Insert. And there it is, ready to roll. Anyway, my point here was to show you how to use iZip if you're using an Apple product. So that's it. I hope this helps. Thank you. Bye-bye.